customize your gear like a pro. In this video, we're going to be showing you 11 ways to customize your football gear like a pro. Now, gear can include all sorts of things. It could include your boots, could include compression shorts. We could be talking about socks, studs, laces, your shin pads, your gear bag, all sorts of more. For each one, we're going to give them a rating in this video and let you know what we think of them out of 10. Right. So one of the big things I want to show you is coming up at the end of the video. Make sure you stay tuned to see those. But before we do that, let's get in and start things off with number one. Soul conversions. We are talking about a hugely popular hack with players where they take a firm ground boot, but they put a soft ground sole plate onto it. And they do that by enlisting the help of somebody like Lose Boots who will do a customization. They take Adidas or Nike boots, Puma, whatever it happens to be, and they take off the plastic studs and they switch them in for the metal ones. And the reason they do this is players really prefer those firm ground sole plates compared to the soft ground ones. They find them more flexible, they find them more lightweight, especially with Nike and their anti-clog sole plate. They're finding that in recent years, they're not getting the flexibility in the light boots that they want. So they're going ahead and they're switching the studs out for them. The solution is a saw, a drill, some technical know-how about studs, and the other thing they can do is they can add in specific different lengths of studs in different places as the players want. So you can get a mix between that firm ground and um, soft ground version. That's why they were called the pro stud com uh, configurations because they were what the pros were wearing on the pitch. Hack rating wise, we're gonna give this one a seven out of 10 and uniqueness is probably a four out of 10. It's not that unique, um, but overall a very decent hack to start the video. Another hugely popular thing at the moment with players is to take the color out of their boots ditch the color you've got a lot of bright bold boots nowadays they really stand out on pitch but a lot of players are opting to go for a blackout so this is another service which is offered by lose boots and you get your black boots sometimes you see players wearing blackout boots on pitch for two reasons one they're disguising an upcoming release so perhaps nike or adidas have got some new boots coming out and they don't want to show us what the boots are right now a new generation of something and you'll see players wearing those before they come out the other time though and you often see players wearing them in game more like this is when they're wearing blackout boots because their contract with a brand is running out or perhaps they're looking for a new boot deal and so they're wearing blackout boots they don't want to give any exposure to the boot companies and instead they want to put on the market that hey i'm available for a new boot deal so you see quite a few players doing that nowadays it's much more popular but also players like to do it just because um, they like black boots or also because they're in an academy team or something so then they're told that they have to wear black boots and they can't go with those crazy colors that you see on so many boots nowadays even um, the more understated blackout releases that come out often have a bright accent color added to them and so you can go ahead and get that blacked out as well that's something that Lou boots will do for you as well so this hack we are going to give a rating of six out of ten and as for uniqueness, we're gonna give it a three out of 10 because it's not that unique players and people have been doing it for quite a long time. Um, and it's gonna keep happening whilst people wanna hide up their boot deals or just wanna wear those nice classy black boots. So the most noticeable customization you see for big name players are signature boots. So players like Pogba, Messi, Ronaldo, Mane, Mbappe, all the big names end up getting their signature boots. Sterling has just got his new signature boots with New Balance. I don't know if they're going to be ready retail, but big name players get their own boots. But the thing is, it isn't just big name players can get their own boots. Anybody can get their own boots. If you go ahead and use a service like the Nike, Nike by you, then you can create your own boots and your own designs. And you can even add your own kind of name and stuff to the boots as well. So for example, we made our own pair of YouTube inspired football boots, red and white with a black and orange swoosh. We got the orange laces and you can also add in your little name personalization stuff. So this is available in all of the latest Nike boots with the Mercurial uh, by you and also by the Phantoms as well. So you can go ahead and make your own designs. A lot of people do and you get your own very unique pair of boots. So thinking about a rating for this hack, we're gonna give this one a seven out of 10 uniqueness wise we're gonna give it a nine out of 10 because you are really gonna end up with a super unique boot. Nobody else is gonna have something just the same as you. There are so many colors and options that you can really create something special for yourself and stand out on pitch with your name across the side of them as well. Get your own signature edition. 
The next hack we're going to talk about is boot ID. So obviously this follows on from making your own boots, but if you've got a standard pair of boots, something that could just goes at retail, you can still get your own name and number applied to these when you buy them in the store. So you can go ahead and get um, either stickers applied to the upper when you get them from the store or also some places will do stitching on the upper as well and then you can get also your flag um, and some initials or a name short name depending on the space that there is on the boots and that's something that works on the general retail releases rather than getting your own whole custom boot designed now the other thing you can do is if you've already got a pair of boots then you can go ahead and get something like these id your game transfers and what you do is you line these up and apply them to the boots yourself you can just push down with a pencil or something like that and it makes the transfer go onto the boot it is um, semi-permanent it won't stay on there forever it will last quite a few wears though they can get wet and all kind of stuff like that um, and in fact they are relatively hard to get off you do need to use an eraser to make sure they come off I would recommend lining them all up using a bit of tape and making sure you get all the letters as line it straight up as you want them to be because when you get them on the boot you don't want to have them go all a bit wonky so if you've got them on some tape it will make it much easier to apply them as for a hack rating on this one we're going to give this hack rating a 6 out of 10 and the uniqueness of this idea we're going to give it a 4 out of 10 because it isn't that unique you've seen a lot of player name customizations happening for a long time on boots so this is something really unique to look at these are made by eos and they are compression shorts but the unique thing about them the customizable thing about them is you can get your own picture applied to the shorts and you can also get names and wording added as well so you, eos sent us a couple of pairs they sent us these football boots ones with our logo on it and also these Jaden sancho Borussia dortmund inspired ones um, for um Sancho, so they're on the shorts themselves. Um, they can be warning games. You can see them underneath your normal football shorts if you want to, um, but it's something super customizable. You can add any picture you like, so you can send them a picture and they will add that to the shorts or they'll design something for you as well. A really unique idea. So 10 out of 10 in the uniqueness factor. As for a hack, um, is it really a hack? Perhaps not, but it is definitely something unique you can do for your football. So we will give this one a five out of 10 for the compression shorts with your own personalization on it. So another one you can go ahead and customize is your gear bag. You may have the same gear bag as a few players in your team. You can get your name and your number embroidered on the bag. Then nobody's going to go off with your gear, your boots, anything like that. You'll know which is yours. Maybe um, a flag or, as I say, name or number. The other thing you can do is if you have a smaller bag, you can get embroidery put on that. So this was sent to us by the guys at Bootchamp and um, it's a cleaning bag. But as you can see, you can get your logo embroidered on it. You can even get your club logo added to it. Um, but yeah, Bootchamp sent us that one. That's just one idea for embroidering some of your gear stuff. Overall hack rating, probably a three out of 10 and uniqueness again, three out of 10 because overall it's gonna look pretty much the same. It's just gonna have that little bit of customization so that you know it's yours. All right, another hack we're gonna talk about is something that ends up hidden underneath your socks. It is shin pads. So there's all sorts of different types of shin pads available on the market, but players are going ahead and customizing theirs. So we actually had some sent to us by Shin Art and they've got Zidane on one of the shin pads and then our Football Boots logo on the other one. People go ahead and put their selves on there, their family on there, things that they support, anything like that. You can even put your own kind of designs on, anything that you're inspired by and they end up under your socks. As for a hack rating, we're gonna give this one a four out of 10. And as for uniqueness, we'll give it a five out of 10. Um, it's one of those ones where it's hidden again, so it's not perhaps as standout as some of the others in this video. So the next hack we're talking about is to do with your grip socks. Now, I suppose it could be any socks. There are a lot of different grip socks on the market. You have got the likes of Socks Pro, Tape Design, uh, grip so I've got their own socks. Everybody seems to have their own grip socks at the moment. But the customization, the personalization, the pro ID hack with it is, is adding your initials or your name or your number to the upper part of the sock. In fact, Mesut Ozil got his own tape design socks range made for him and it had his Mesut Ozil logo. Um, and a lot of players have got their country flag or their names and initials on them. Again, you don't get them confused with other players' socks. Um, also, it's just a little way of standing out on pitch. Um, as for a hack rating, we're gonna give this a four out of 10. Uniqueness again, four out of 10. It's a little bit different, but it's not um, a real big standout thing. And also it's gonna get hidden under your socks um, when you're wearing them in match so people aren't actually gonna see them. So customizing your grip socks is one of our hacks. Next, we're gonna look at studs. So they are the metal ones that you can change in your boots. Adidas, Nike, both have the uh, very similar studs, slightly different lengths or threads on them, same as Puma, but um, things haven't changed much there. Customization wise, you can get all sorts of different colors and change them if you want. But the thing is, nobody's really gonna see them when the boots are on the ground. You can't see 
what is underneath. But what you can do in customize is you can go ahead and you can get some um, different studs. So these are the grip star studs and they're designed to be um, able to change height. You can fit them into Adidas Nike Puma boots, doesn't matter which ones they are. They give you uh, better traction, that adjustable height as I was talking about. Um, they also kind of got better pressure absorption as you uh, run on them and they've got that long lasting performance as well. Um, so grip start is the one option and then the other option you can consider is going with the new smart power studs. So Smart Power are super interesting. They kind of started off in rugby. They are a French company and they've moved into doing football as well. And in fact, Cristiano Ronaldo is one player who's actually given these a go and you can adjust them to different heights and levels and um, directions depending on what you're doing. They are quite aggressive and they're available in the metal and um, plastic for firm ground as well. And you adjust the washers to line up how you want these to fit on the boots. Um, quite a game changer there. Um, and something that Ronaldo has tried, as I say. So you've got different positions depending on um, what you want to do and how you want to use them. As you can see, it talks about front rows, second rows, that's um, obviously for rugby. And then you've got positions for comfort and for um, all sorts of different things. So something to consider. The Smart Power studs are designed to give you more acceleration, lateral stability, more thrust, enhance comfort and reduce fatigue. So overall, hack-wise, we are gonna give this hack uh, a five out of 10. It does have some performance benefits, but you aren't gonna be able to see the uh, colors of the studs so much. These will stand out when you look at them like this, but when they're turned over, you won't. Uh, uniqueness, um, it is pretty unique actually to see something a bit different like this, especially these Smart Power studs. They're definitely something unique con to consider. So we'll give this a seven out of 10 in the uniqueness factor. So laces or lacquer laces is a big thing in football at the moment. Um, but if we take the laceless boots out of the equation for a while and we talk about laces, laces is a great opportunity for you to add some color, some flair to your boots. Players do that and change things around. Uh, Marcus Rashford, he added um, some details to his special boots that he got from Nike playing for England with the black boots with the details on them. A great opportunity to add a little bit extra. You see it on the tips of some of the laces of pro player signature boots as well. There's a couple of big campaigns around laces, one with Nike and their red campaign tied into HIV, and the other one, the rainbow laces campaign tied into Pride and LGBT. So your opportunity to use something like uh, Lasex Pro, or you can go Ammo Customs, and you can use um, different colors to personalize the boots for yourself. As a hack, we are gonna give this one a four out of 10 for our hack rating, and we'll also go uniqueness, four out of 10. It's not that different, it's not that special, but it is a good opportunity to just do a little change, something for yourself on your boots. Saving the best to last, this is my favorite hack out of all of these pro player ID hacks, and we are talking about painted boots. So we've been doing this for a while, we've been painting boots and it is becoming more and more mainstream. You're seeing the likes of uh, Pete Zhang, uh, Jordan Dawson, Shoe Doctor, Exclusive Customs, S with a Dot, Silni Art, all sorts of painters are coming and players are wanting their boots customized. They are wanting their own personal painted designs on the boots. This is a football boots inspired one, but you are seeing the likes of Neymar. He has got Fortnite inspired boots. They've been painted up for him. Neymar also, when he launched his connection with Puma, he ended up actually having hand painted boots to make that signature look on those. And there are so many pro players getting these. Serie A, you see it a lot. You get a few in the Premier League. Um, in La Liga as well. Players are getting these painted boots. Griezmann has worn painted boots. So many players going for their own painted boots. Even Man City's last game of the season, uh, Zinchenko and Aguero had Puma boots that were designed specifically with customizations on the side of them. There's so many white boots at the moment, it makes it really easy to add these designs and art onto them. It happened with the Future Zs and it also has happened with these uh, Puma Ultras as well. A hack rating on this, we have to give it a 10 out of 10 and uniqueness. Each boot is personally crafted for that player. And so for that reason, they are the most unique thing you can do to your boots, to your football gear. And as such, we're gonna give them a 10 out of 10 as well. Guys, share your favorite ID hacks in the comments below. Thanks very much for watching. Go enjoy your football.